live from Midtown Manhattan, the Cube's live coverage of Big Data NYC, a Silicon Angle Wikibon production, made possible by Hortonworks, We Do Hadoop, and Wham Disco, Hadoop Made Invincible. And now your co-hosts, John Furrier and Dave Vellante. Okay, welcome back to uh, Big Data NYC. We are live in New York City, right across the street from the Hilton Hotel, where Hadoop World is happening, and also Strata Conference. This is Big Data NYC, our event where we extract the signal from the noise. I'm John Furrier, my co-host, Dave Vellante. We have the co-founder of Hortonworks here, Arun Murthy, uh, architect as well at Hortonworks, a big player in the space. Uh, great to have you on again. You're a CUBE alumni, great to see you. I know, I feel like, <laughs> you know, it's, it, I, I keep doing this all the time, you know, hanging out with you guys. Fun. Every year it's always like, CUBE alumni, and but you, your celebrity status gets bigger and bigger <laughs> every year. I remember when we first interviewed you, you were very humble, still humble, but like, you know, now you're, it's growing up. Yeah. Hadoop is mainstream, it's not just uh, software. Absolutely. There's stuff in Hadoop, on top of Hadoop, around Hadoop. A lot of, lot of things going on. So Absolutely. Yeah, I mean, obviously, you, you know, you guys follow it. It's, uh, you know, we've had Hadoop 2 go GA in the last uh, few weeks. And on the back of that, we had uh, Hortonworks Data Platform 2.0 go GA. So it's fun time. And, you know, like I was chatting with uh, Jeff offline, I feel like I spent three, four years in a cave right now and I'm just getting out. The world's kind of changed. Uh, but it's, you know, there's still the sun and the moon and the stars, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> that lot of change. And, and trees are a little taller. Exactly. <laughs> right. uh, but on the other hand, it's it's really great to see sort of a you know mainstream adoption of Hadoop uh, across you know various segments of the industry, um, and that's reflected in you know in not just our customer base, but also you know the kind of people who show up at events like this, and the amount of interest they generate in Hadoop. It's pretty. Um, it's, in, in a lot of ways, it's humbling. So the data platform is, but is the top story <coughs> here uh, at, uh, in New York City because mainly the, the obviously not just the technology but the market fit for the, on the business Absolutely. value side. You're seeing um, the, the big data application tsunami hitting. We were just I just tweeted you know, the internet created the killer app email. Big data has created the the killer app analytics. Right. So yeah. everything everything's all about the application. So there's some form of big data in all applications going forward. So there's a lot of pressure. So what is the the key? innovation right now that's in the data platform that you guys announced and, and, and what's relevant? Yeah, for us, you know, it's obviously been Hadoop Yarn. Um, as we've talked about in the past, Yarn is all about taking Hadoop beyond just batch processing and getting to a point where you can run real-time data analytics, streaming applications, interactive, you know, SQL queries, batch processing, all of it on a sort of a common platform across your data center. So think of it as a fabric that you put in your data center and everything else, you know, vectors on top. So it's a really key, it's, you know, it's a really key innovation in Hadoop. Um, you know, I, I, I can't stress it enough. It's the second generation of Hadoop architecture. It's not just Hadoop 2.0, it's also the next generation of the architecture. Um, and this happens, you know, once in, you know, you know, seven years at this point, seven, eight years. That's a really big deal. Um, and we feel like now that it's out, it's going to mean a lot of, you know, interesting ways for us to collaborate with the rest of the ecosystem. Uh, we're seeing not just open source projects, uh, whether it's uh, you know Storm, which you just announced for real-time analytics, streaming applications, but also things like you know proprietary applications which are coming on top, and w the way they're looking at this is to say we've got all this data in Hadoop. Now, how do we you know account for that our applications, right, and you know add value to the customer? And that's a really key way to look at Hadoop and you know what it's going to do. Okay, thanks for coming on the cube. We are live in New York City for Big Data NYC. We uh, get the movers and shakers, newsmakers, entrepreneurs, CEOs, venture capitalists here on theCUBE. We're announcing products. We announced a startup yesterday. This is theCUBE, I'm John with Dave, and we'll be right back after this short break. <laughs>